Hey everybody, it is Joanne here at DJD. How's it going everybody? Um, you are here for the final live class. Final live class going on. And, ooh, I have two, two people watching, hello. Um, so yeah, my name is Joanne. Um, I'm happy to be here for our final live class here uh, at DJD. Um, it is a very lonely place around here. I've actually been um, isolating or staying home and staying healthy. Um, so this is my first time being back at the center in a couple of weeks and it is surely missing all of our awesome individuals um, who frequent this place. Uh, so I do hope uh, that we open up soon and that you can all come back and fill up our space with the awesome energy that you always do. Um, so I am the fifth class, so that means that I've learned a few things from my wonderful uh, colleagues in crime. Uh, that means that I've been working on my cardio because um, I don't want to feel as out of breath as my friends have felt. So um, I've worked on my cardio and I'm hopefully going to be pacing really well. Uh, I also learned that I don't have to reverse everything, which is absolutely phenomenal. Uh, so that's really awesome. Um, I've also learned that I am going to turn off the comment uh, situation after a little bit of the warm-up because I was getting a bit frustrated I don't know if you guys were but I was getting a bit frustrated that I couldn't see my friends feet our work um, here at DJD is so rhythm based that uh, and a lot of that rhythm kind of happens in our feet and so the comments are kind of going over top of our feet so what I'm gonna do is probably oh maybe kind of like 10 minutes in I'm gonna turn off commenting and then at the end, I'll turn them back on. But it means you get to keep commenting. Comment all the way through, and then at the end of class, it'll go and we'll have all these comments. We'll have a bit of a stretch, it'll be awesome. Um, stuff like that. So, first things first, we're gonna have a little groove warm up. Um, I also wanna just give a bit of an acknowledgement uh, to my awesome friend, Caleb, um, and hopefully he's in there. Um, because Caleb uh, provides me with mixed tapes, quote unquote. Um, and so two of the tracks that you're going to hear are courtesy of my dear friend Caleb. First one uh, being, um, uh, what do we have here? First one is uh, Little Things by Sumi Colin. So he's going to have our first, uh, our first track up here for our warm up. And then you get to hear a piece that Caleb has been masterfully working on a little bit later. All right, so let's get going. Uh, as I said, I'll kind of get, give you, get you to give me some thumbs up with regards to volume. I am kind of doing my own, uh, my own uh, music today. Um, I don't have an awesome partner in crime. So, uh, but look, there's where the music is. So it's not gonna be too hard. So if you need, um, if, you, if I all ask, hey, is the music good? And if it is good, then we'll be good. Awesome. Okay, glasses off so that I uh, don't have them falling off. All right, here we go, friends. Yeah. 
Everybody's waving, it's enjoyable. Some of you, I have no idea who you are, but I'm really glad to see you. Awesome, you guys. Okay, I am gonna turn off commenting, but keep the commenting coming. All right, turn it off. So now you're gonna be able to see me. No, look, you can still give me hearts. So that's enjoyable, very good. Okay, gotta grab a quick drink. See, look at, see? Good cardio, not out of breath, we're good. When I was planning this class, I wanted to go back and, and look at all my books and go, what exercises do I really love? And what exercises have my students loved? And what is gonna fit, <laughs> this is the challenge, what is gonna fit inside of Instagram's panel of fun? Those of you who know me know that I really love moving big. And so this has been a bit of a challenge this week to kind of figure that out. Uh, so if I go out of, out of uh, range, I promise I'll come back. Hopefully you have a good amount of space and are good and safe right now as far as uh, not bashing into anything. All right, so this is one of my favorite uh, warm-ups. Uh, Ernestine Anderson, please send me someone to love. Rhythm in our feet. Dig step, dig step, dig step, ball change. Five, six, Seven, eight, dig step, dig step, dig step, ball change. Five, six, last time, dig step, dig step, dig step, ball change. All right, with that, each time you dig, give me a hit with the corresponding shoulder, just like we did in that warm up. Hey oh, hey oh, hey oh, bum bum. Five and a six and a seven, we go. A one, a two, a three, ball change. Last time then, we're walking around. A one, two, three, walk around, step, chug, chug, step. So left, 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 right, six, dig, we go. Boom, uh, two, uh, three, five, six, seven, and eight. Last time. After we do it this last time, you're gonna go right away onto the left. Six, seven, and eight, dig, step, dig, step, dig, step. Walk, walk, step, chug, chug, left. A one, a two, a three, five, six, seven, and eight. Yes? I hope so. After we do that, you have circle, release, figure eight. Circle, release, figure wrap. Do that again, right arm, feel this circle, not just in the shoulder, tail to tail to head. Circle, release, figure eight. 
circle, release, figure wrap. After the wrap, stand tall, big curve, reach to me, relax, bend the knees, roll yourself up. You do all of that on the left. We go. Awa. Ball change. You'll walk. Step. Right side. Walk. Left arm is circle and swing. Figure eight. Circle and swing. Figure right. Stand. Curve. Reach. Relax. Bend the knees. Roll yourself up. Okay? So, that is part one of three things that we're going to do in this warm-up. Okay? Actually, that's part two. Part one is arching and rolling, melting and growing. Whatever feels good in your body. So I can arch, holding on to my lower abdominals so that I'm protecting the lower back and then rolling. I can do it center or I can do it into any of those corners. Melt. Ooh. Just taking yourself down. Try not to get over dramatic about the whole situation. Just try and melt it. You'll hear the song. It's dramatic enough. Emulate the song, okay? Uh, the third thing that we're gonna do, you're just gonna follow me. We're gonna do a bunch of reaches a la Luigi. <sighs> Softened, heavy chest, feeling the reach, feeling the curve, right? We're gonna feeling those shapes we're gonna feel some opposition with some opposite uh, shoulder action. And that's it. And then I'll just keep yelling, like I always do. Ask anybody who's taken a class from me. All right, so as soon, hello, as soon as we hear her words, you're gonna uh, start arching, rolling, melting, growing. <laughs> Don't say 
here and, and certainly uh, the work that Kim creates for the, uh, for the company. Sometimes, yeah, we need to kind of like work on that supporting leg and work on uh, rotation as well as para parallel. Um, but sometimes we just need to groove. And so technique for those sort of more um, uh, proficient, I don't even think that that's the right word, but technique for something doesn't have to equal the technique for something else, okay? So, as Jamie was saying, we kind of create these longer exercises because sure, we'd like you to get your quads and your hamstrings ready for things, and sure, we could, you know, call those a plie, but at the end of the day, we're just doing knee bends, and at the end of the day, if we just sat here and put music on and did knee bends, that wouldn't be very fun. So, we're gonna dance before we do the knee bends, and this is what we're gonna do. Uh, your rhythm. Clap it with me. Here we go. Ba, ba, di, ga, da. Five and a six, so one more time. Ba, ba, di, ga, da. We're gonna do. Oh, heel, toe, heel, ball change. Five and a six, you go heel, toe, heel, ball change. Again, the last time. Heel, toe, heel, ball change. Now, give me a triple step. Triple step. Wow, I can hardly do a triple step. I have to stand the frame. Triple step, kick ball change. Kick ball change. So. Clap it with me. Here you go. Back. Oh, hang on. Are your knees straight? Because you know I hate when we clap like this. Five, a six, a seven, eight, a one. Five, six, dance it with me, a heel, toe, heel, triple, kick, ball change. Yes? We'll get it. It's going to repeat a lot. After that, time, kick, ball change. Famous for my walk around. Uh, triple step, kick, ball change. One, two, three, four. New rhythm. <laughs> Clap it with me. Here we go. Clap it with me one more time. So we have this. Walk. Da, ku, ah. That 
was that rhythm? Ba, do, di, do, da. Ba, do, di, do, a. Now, if you were successful at what I just did, which was a step chug, ball change, drag, you can do that. Or you stand around, one, two, three, four, di, do, da, di, a. Clap it with me and then finish it fla flare with, uh, with the drag. From the top, here we go. A heel. Ball change. Triple step. And a one. Here it is. Three, four. Step chuck. Ball change track. We circle. We circle. We're heel and toe and heel and toe. Step. A step. A four times. No, I lied. Three times to reach out. How did that go? Maybe? Drag. Circle. Circle. We heel and toe and heel and toe. A step, a two, a three. A get ready, bend and stretch and bend. Easy arms, deep in the bend. Knees are out, five, sit, do it again. Bend and stretch. Easy elbows and shoulders. One, two, three, four. Dissolve it because we go left. Oh, one, two, three. Five, a six, a eight, a oh one. Here it is. D, e, da, e, a. Circle the foot, circle the foot. Heel and toe, heel and toe. Step and step and step. We'll do it again. Okay? Maybe. Trust me, we're going to do it a few times. I hope you'll be fine. I know you'll be fine. Okay, let's just get the right track. All right, so uh, this lovely uh, track that we're about to listen to is Bass and Street Blues, Preservation Hall Jazz Band with Merle Haggard. This was an album that was created uh, in response to Katrina. So it's a great album. You should check it out. All right, let's listen. Let's put this new feel in our bodies. Take those hands, push. Let me. 
hamstrings, working on the rotation and the safe practice of abdominals and lower back and blah, blah, blah. We just get to have a nice little time. So that's most important. Okay, what is next? I got my post-it notes of knowledge in the back and we are going to do, ooh, okay. So, uh, slight disclaimer, it's feeling pretty good, but I kind of have wrenched my knee. And so there's a lot of things that um, just hurt. <laughs> so I'm like, well, we just won't do those things. However, the exercise that this particular groove went with is highly enjoyable, but kind of like Basin Street, this next one is going to kind of be the same in that it has like this really enjoyable sort of um, groove part to it. And then there was some things where we like worked on our hamstrings. Okay, so we're going to do the fun part. So this piece of music is called Pet the Cat by the Dirty Dozen Brass Band. Okay, hey, by the way, we are going to provide a Spotify list from all five of our classes so if you're just wondering what all the great music has been, wait for it, it will be coming. Okay, so uh, the basis of this uh, groove that's gonna happen is walking, okay? And as my wonderful friend Jason Stroh says, 90% uh, of all dance is knowing when to transfer your weight and when not to transfer your weight. He kind of does that action as well. So let's think about that again. When to transfer your weight and when not to transfer your weight, okay? So we're gonna have a couple of unique ways that we transfer our weight. First way, not so unique, is just a basic walk, right? Now, it's not the walk that you do going down the street. I want you to put it in your knees. One and two and three and four. One and two. Don't get rid of that upbeat feel, right? Because the upbeat allows it to not be stiff, and uh, vacant in our torso. Boom, okay? Uh, another unique thing about these walks is opposed to when we walk forward and we go heel toe, and our tendency might be in our, uh, on the spot to go toe heel on those walks. I want you to hit this floor, uh, f hit the foot onto the floor as flatly as possible, right? Boom, boom, ah, uh, boom, ah, uh, boom, ah, uh, boom. Yeah, and so what ends up happening when I do that is I ultimately can either do this, but then my torso feels really left out, or I just get rid of the thing that was in the way, which is those hips, yeah? So just sending those hips back. Those are gonna be the walks that we do. We're also gonna have um, a variation of a push down. So those of you who are around this place often, here's our push down. We're actually gonna do ones that sort of have a little bit more of a sideways feel. It's gonna actually start with the down, down, push, down, push, down, push, down. Down, push, down, push, down, push, down. And again, my bum needs to kind of get out of the way. I could absolutely do this, but then you can see it's really vertical and I haven't given opportunity. I think Kaya talked about those five bends that um, Kim Cooper, our artistic director, always talks about. One, two, three, four, and five. So really accessing those, Gika, gika, ga. Gika, gika, ga. Okay? Uh, third way of transferring our weight is an up, up, down. Up, up, down. Up, up, down. Now I'm making them big so that you can see them. And I'm making them relatively small. And, well, sorry, let's say that again. I'm making them big, but I'm also making them slow. Okay? We're going to take those up a little bit. Diga, da. Diga, da. 
dig it up, dig it up, okay? That is gonna be our rhythm play, all right? So, I'm not gonna set anything quite yet, we're just gonna kind of meander our way through the entire song, likely, until we final, finally come up with the groove um, at the end. All right, here we go.
Hopefully you're still with me. So here's what we're gonna do, my friends. We're gonna take our walks. Walk. Left. One, two, three, four. Hey. Walk, walk, then we're on the left. Yes? Hopefully that's gonna be enjoyable for you. Sounds like we're right in the middle of a dance break. Let's find it. Now I would mention, if we were all over 18, we might need, you know, a shot of rum with this one. Might help, or just at least envision a shot of rum. All right. I don't miss the second part of that at all. Not that many of you know what it is, but those of you who do, I don't miss it. I don't miss it. Okay, um, another groove. Um, and this is where we can start to work a little bit more on those hamstrings, okay? So I'm gonna give you two options for uh, what you can do if you, um, to access uh, those hamstrings. We're just gonna think about those hamstrings uh, in one way, only going to the front. Uh, mm, no, we can do them all four places. But then we're gonna have an alternative that is a little less um, kind of put together, okay? Uh, the more important part of the whole situation is the groove. And here is where my dear friend Caleb um, has provided me with a beautiful little short song that gives me such joy. It really does. So, uh, super easy and mostly this is all gonna be about how you insert yourself into this groove. So, I'm not gonna give you what I think the groove is. We will listen to it before we get going uh, so that you have an understanding. Uh, actually, no, I'm gonna make it be a surprise and you can like it. Oh, that's enjoyable. Uh, by the way, take, uh, Caleb DeCeste, uh, is the song is called Yo. Could be because of me, I doubt it, but it could be. Um, okay, so you're gonna go back and back. We're falling, fall and fall. Then those same kind of um, uh, push downs, but we're gonna come forward. Go, 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 go. One and two and three. Take it back again. One and two and three and four. Keep it neutral so that you don't know what's coming. Five, six, seven, step. Okay? So uh, if you are going to do option A, which is a little bit more relaxed, it's going to look like this. So we just finished going five and six and seven. Actually, you could probably just go eight finish that little bar right there. Then you're gonna go one and two and three and four. Take it side, one and two and three and four. Take it back, and two and three and four. Take it side, one and two and three 
and four. Okay, so that is option one for your hamstring exploration. Option two, five and six and seven step together. Okay, feeling a bit more of a supportive, where am I centered? There we go. Feeling a bit more supported, but we're gonna just gonna take up and up and up and up. You can flex your feet, do whatever you need to do. You're in parallel to the front. You rotate the legs to go to your corners. You stay rotated, you stay rotated, okay? So we should end up all at the same time to come back to doing the fun part, okay? So we are gonna do fall back four times with a bit of a, a pulse. Take it forward, push down, just two times, and then do that all again. Fall, 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 push down, push down either relaxed it four times to the front or a little bit more cultivated. We're going front, we're going side, we're going back, we're going side. We finish, we congratulate ourselves, that was awesome. But then we do the fun part again. Yes? Okay. All right, got my, my volume up. You have four clicks, four clicks, and then we go. comments on just so that we can see who is here there we go oh hello y'all there you all are um, yeah put your shoes on my friends if they're not already I'm going to and I'll put a piece of music on of course I am. it will show you the direction that we're about to go remember things anymore. So uh, we're going to endeavor to do these in three minutes so that we have an understanding of this feel. Now, if you were doing stuff with Jamie yesterday, you had a bit of that sense of finding our double bounce. All right? So that's what we need to do. Okay, I put it up on the mirror so that I don't get missed. Okay, I'm going to, sorry guys, I'm going to turn the comments off again. I'll be back in a minute. All right, off with the commenting so that you can see me. Yeah. 
as well as uh, uh, Jump Rhythm Jazz Project in Chicago. Hi, Jeannie, if you're out there. But the way that Ms. Hill does this is really what I feel the groove. E da da, do ba da, a uh, 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 uh. Yes? Top. Six, a five, six, eight, a one. Two travel sugars, eight, a one, two, me. Ha, 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 ha. Kick ball change, kick ball change. Yeah, no. Uh, uh, uh. Maybe. Now I know that the the thing on the four, my thing on the four, kind of makes it feel a bit weird. Trust, trust. All right, here we go, my friends. This is a track called "Hi Hat" by Swing Republic. We go. <laughs>
Okay, so we're then gonna take this rhythm. Five, six, clap it with me, we go. Feet go. Uh, 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 uh. Five, six, seven, and eight. Right, left, right, left, right, left. Five, six, try it again, we go right. Left and stop. After that, you're going to do Suzy Q. Now, in the world of Instagram, I'm going to move over there. I don't want to leave you. So, I'm going to go around the corner and do a quick tight turn so that the Suzy Q's are going to be with my butt facing you. And we're going to go this way. Okay? So, slow walk. Six, five, six, seven, eight, one. Do da da go around the corner and stop. How do we do? Yeah? This time, come all the way around the corner. Okay? So we're gonna do a quick turn and then we're gonna keep until we're back here. Nice little circle. Five, six, camel walks, we go slow. Hey, ho, hey, Susie Q. Coming around. Yes? Slide. Slide. Yeah, feet, footwork goes. Slide, slide. We go. Slide, slide. Nice. Go from our cam walk. Six, a five, six, seven, eight. Oh, 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 Susie Q. All the way around. Slide, slide. Finishing it off, my friends, we're so close. My step, you've already done that on the left, just once. Ba, do, da, do, da. Kick, ball change, ball change. Kick, ba, do, ba, do. Kind of takes us down the hill. My step, kick, ball change, ball change. Five, six, seven, eight, uh. Do, ga, da, ga, da. Maybe, one more time. Five, six, seven, eight, my step. Ba, da, ba, da. Maybe, baby. Top. Six, five, six, seven, eight, one, one, four, five. Travel it. One. My step. Two kicks. Tack any. Into camel walk. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Susie Q. Coming around. We go. Ooh. Ah. My step. How do we do? Ish. Do an ish. Okay, let's give it a try. Let's do that a couple more times. I'll engage the commentary. Engage the commentary. Ooh, oh, Annalise is there. Somebody said hi to Annalise. Very good. All right, friends, let's do this again. <laughs>
I have no idea what I'm doing. I am just like doing this and having fun. I hope you guys had a great time. Stretch it out, keep breathing, have fun. Bye guys, see you soon I hope. Love you.